Do your headlights look like shit? No, seriously, I mean, I'm hoping they're not quite as bad as these ones because they're just fucked. It's a train. So, what can we do to restore headlights that look crap like these? Oh, I got a plane now. Piss off. Big metal bird. It's like I was saying, in order to take care of these headlights, you can use stuff like this. This is Formula One's Headlight Restorer. Kind of acts like a cut and polish, uh, but for your headlights, it takes away everything like that. And kind of different to a cut and polish, it also seals as well. So we should be able to take the top layer of all of this crap off, leaving the nice good plastic underneath to be seen. And this should be able to seal it so it doesn't go quite as crappy quite so quickly. So let me show you how it works. So the first step when it comes to using a headlight restorer is you're going to want to clean up your headlights as much as you can. Ideally, this would be with a bucket of water and suds. Get like a cloth or a sponge and just start going to town, get that nice and clean, and then give it a good dry off. Um, I don't have a bucket and some suds with me. I just couldn't be bothered to grab it. So instead, I'm using this stuff, cleaning wipes, uh, because it says that the lemon formula is good for grease, tar, paint, dirt, oil, silicone adhesives, and much more. And that's good enough for me. Love it when people straight pipe diesels. Right, so yeah, like I was saying, clean. So directions for actually using this stuff and not just prepping the headlight. You wanna give this thing a good shake, um, kind of like any cut and polish really, uh, as probably all of you will know. You need to mix it in because I think we've all made that mistake where we've gone to, you know, polish something and we've squirted out the first bit of polish and it just looks fucked. Like I keep saying over and over like a broken record, treat it like a polish because it kind of is like a polish for your headlights. So like I said, small circular motions, work it in, should see some results. Like I said, small amount. We don't want to go fucking ape shit with this. Also, I feel like this is a good time to mention. A lot of you seem quite aggro that I'm shitting on this thing. Um, please note, I'm shitting on this thing. I'm not shitting on your Falcon. Um, and whenever I make an assumption about your Falcon, uh, it's based on this one. Uh, so I'm sure you have a nice Falcon. I've seen quite a few of yours and they are really nice. <laughs> All right, so once you have worked that in, what you're gonna to wanna to do is just buff it. And for me, I'm just gonna use the same cloth. Cloths are versatile. You can fold them over and look at that, it's clean. So there you go, just like that. A little bit of elbow grease and $14 before any super saver discounts. You can get headlights like a mint like these. Now be honest, these aren't perfect. These Falcon headlights, the plastics have actually started sort of eroding away. So that's why they've sort of got this funny textured finish that isn't really, wanted but as you can see they are a hell of a lot cleaner than the side want a reminder of what they used to look like here's what the other side looked like yeah not ideal so now i'm going to go to the other side of this and i don't know maybe you should jump on online a little bit parts you can set up a bottle if you've got crappy plastic headlights like we do see ya